he just went back up in there hey girl welcome back to the vlog just got ready for the day i threw on this little black dress is from hollister it's actually like a summer dress like a fall summer dress because it has a split on the side but i kind of wanted to wear a dress today so i figured i could wear it with my tall ugg boots and maybe it could be a little look so i'll show you guys like what that looks like i'm gonna try doing a little bit of christmas shopping today i'm not sure what i'll be able to get done because i do have an appointment at one o'clock with my endocrine doctor which it's like smack in the middle of the day and i really wish i would have gotten an earlier appointment maybe they didn't have one i don't know but i hate one o'clock appointments i feel like i can't really do much before and then i can't really do much after because yeah it's just an awkward time i am thinking about doing a little solo date today though so i'm thinking i will find a restaurant i think i have one in mind because I want to try a few different sushi rolls that you guys recommended to me. I think I wrote down like five or six rolls that recommended to me a few videos ago. Today I'm wearing this gloss from Lancome. It's one of my favorites. I'm actually going to make myself some iced coffee. So these are the boots I'm going to wear. Just my Ugg tall boots and these are kind of beat up. But I think they're going to look cute. I think I'm going to hold a sweater as well because I'm not going to want to wear my coat in the mall. But it's going to be too cold to just wear this. So I think I'll hold like a long cardigan. This is the cardigan that I'm wearing. I put this in the fridge a few days ago. So it's nice and cold. using this just a serving of this so i'm trapped in my driveway because the electrical company is fixing like one of the street lights i guess so they're literally parked across the driveway and i'm like i don't want to go up there to ask them how long they're gonna be because i feel like awkward about it but i feel like at this point i'm gonna have to because i've been sitting here for five minutes and they they're just sitting there working i feel like there had to be a different position they could have put that truck in because there's no way that you have to be blocking the driveway like that's i <sighs> okay it's 10 28 i'm gonna wait till 10 30 and then i'm gonna walk down the driveway and kindly ask them how long is it gonna take? I'm gonna go grab my other mic because I wanna be mic'd up when I walk down there so you guys can hear this conversation. I'm so awkward at things like this. I'm gonna go get my other mic. Hold on. BRB. Let's switch to these little mics. So you guys, in case you're interested, I use these mics sometimes. Usually this is the mic that I have on my camera. It's a Sony mic. Um, this is the mic that I have on my camera usually. It's a Sony vlogging mic. Basically, it has a lot of cool functions in the back as well. And then I use these as well when I want to be like more incognito because they're very discreet. Like it's a really, there's a mic, there's something on top of the camera that looks just like this. It's really little. You can't really tell it's a mic. Like when I'm out and about vlogging, I feel like the mic is really what makes me feel super awkward. The camera too, but really it's the mic. So when I have this type of mic on, I don't feel as awkward because it's like so small and it looks more just like a camera instead of like I'm recording my voice. Like, a, you know, it's clearly a mic. This does not look like a mic. Most people don't know that's a mic. Let's go politely ask these gentlemen how long they're gonna take. He just climbed into the little bit. He just went back up in there. There goes my plan. He's literally up in the tree right now. This week has been going not according to plan the entire week. Like, I'm gonna pray that the rest of the week is going smoothly. Yesterday, I took my dad to an appointment, you guys, and it was so much traffic. Like, it's never that much traffic. It took us about an hour and almost, almost two hours, like an hour and 40 minutes to get somewhere that usually takes like 25 minutes and because of all the traffic and how long it took us to get there when we got there he was 
obviously very late to his appointment. And my dad is very punctual. Like, we left with extra time. You know, like, it takes us 25 minutes to get there. But we left 30 minutes before we needed to because he's very punctual, you know. And we still got there so late. And since we were late, they were like, oh, you guys, um, you missed your slot, basically. He had to get a scan done. So he missed his slot. And the next availability for the day it would, have been, would be in two hours. So we had to wait an additional two hours in the waiting room just to get the scan. And then the scan itself took like an hour or so. So I was literally there all day. Like we both were there all day. Like that was not the plan. But yeah, I, th I feel like this week has just been going um this week has just been doing its own thing okay like it's been like girl this is my week his friend is on the ground i'm wondering if i should go ask his friend but i feel like that's kind of hi just looking for your water okay do you know how long this usually takes i don't i don't know what are you trying to get out right? yeah i don't know how long it's gonna take them to do that okay yeah so Oh, you're someone different? Yeah, I'm, I got to mark the water. Oh, okay. Out. They mark the electric, they mark the gas, but I think they're fixing or replacing that transformer, so I don't I don't know how long it takes them to do it. Oh, okay. But one of them guys is a foreman for that, so he should be able to tell you how long. Okay, yeah. I'll okay. find it. Thank okay. you, okay. thank you. <laughs> Girl, I don't know what's going on today. This... He was a whole nother person. He's here for the water. What is going on? Girl, why is everybody, why is all the people here? It oh, okay, perfect. Hi, hey. how long does it usually take? Uh, we're gonna be like five minutes. Five, okay, thank you. Is that okay or you need to get out now? Uh, it's okay, I'll wait. You sure? Yeah, okay. thank you. <laughs> I'm just gonna wait here and answer my emails because I need to anyway and um yeah hang out with you guys I guess maybe we could catch up actually maybe I can get caught up on Real Housewives uh Potomac because I need to get caught up on that and oh I'm caught up on Black Cake I think or maybe there's one episode I need to see but Black Cake is so good you guys I think I told y'all in my last vlog or maybe the one before that there's this episode that i watched so this one episode where um she's in the church um like nun place i don't know what it is like a convent i don't know what it is like where they are i guess they're in a church right and that episode was so sad like i when I, she came in to the house and you know basically she was like she doesn't know what to do but she they convinced her that she wasn't able to to do it right they convinced her basically they, they convinced her that you know she wasn't fit to um to do that job right I don't want to give no spoilers and she basically you know was the felt like yeah it's true which I get it like yeah it, trying her best to not be attached and very detached also the circumstances under which it happened would make you want to be detached anyway but eventually you know she starts to grow a bond I guess and um it's kind of like too late like she signed her life away that one scene where she ran into the um the original nun I just knew like when first of all she just run me the wrong way from the jump like from the start I was like mm, she's given mm, suspicious but like she ran into her and was telling her how she felt and she like it's like what like that is crazy and I'm like what is the motivation like while I'm watching it I'm like, what is the motivation behind that? Because that doesn't make any sense that you would deny that, you know, to somebody. But I, I'm thinking they must get paid by these people, like, a good amount. I don't know, like, the people who come in for the, uh, you know. Either way, that past episode was the last of the book, of, not the book, the, um, the recordings from the mom so I am curious to see like where it goes from there because I don't know like she's done telling her story 
I guess we need to still figure out what happened with that cake at the wedding. Well, we kind of do know at this point, right? Yeah, we kind of do know based on the end of that last episode that I saw, but we still kind of need, like, the solid proof, I guess. I don't know as to, like, what really happened. And then I would like to know what happened to her mom. Like, what's going on with her mom? Where's she at? And then I would also like to know about her best friend back in Jamaica. Like, where is she? Like, I want to (laughs) update. Update me. I need some updates, you know. But yeah, it's a good show. It really is. I haven't seen a good show like that in a minute. Whenever those come around, I get really excited. Because some of these shows, I watch them, but it's like, this is not good. (laughs) Bob said it was going to be five minutes. I think it's like five minutes, so. All right, y'all. So we just pulled into the mall. It's like 11, I think. Let's see what time is it. It's 11.30, so I really only have until 12.30, like an hour, because how do I use this parking ticket? I don't even know. Um, I only have until 12.30 because my appointment's at 1. I'm pretty sure it's at 1. Is it at 1 or is it at 1.20? Shopping in the holiday season is definitely fun. I love seeing the little decorations and like all the the gift sets. I saw some really cute gift sets, so I do like that about it. It's just I feel like I feel like it's hard to shop for people who are. I feel like it's I just feel like it's a little hard to shop for people sometimes. Like kids are perfect. Like my kids tell me exactly what they want, and even if they don't tell me something, I kind of know like what they like. But like grown ups. All the grown-ups around me, I feel like they have everything. <laughs> they literally have everything. Like, you know, I saw this um, TikTok and it was so funny. I wish I say that the TikTok was basically like, don't ask me what I want for Christmas because immediately after I think of something I want, I go buy it. And I'm like, yeah, that's literally true. Like immediately after I think of something, I go buy it. I think I'll actually pick up a pair of Uggs for Callie today on the way home. Because that's something else that I wanted to get her. And I completely forgot while I was at this mall. So maybe I'll get that on the way home. Because I'm going to wrap Clay's. And I know if I wrap Clay's, she's going to be like, how come Clay has two presents and I only have one? So I'm going to get her those so I can wrap that for her as well. Just left the doctor's office. I'm now at the plaza with the uh, sushi restaurant so we're gonna go in hopefully they have I mean they should have students they should have seat in it's literally the middle of the day
Thank you. Lunch was really good. I'm gonna go to Ulta because I have a coupon. Shout out to you guys because I didn't realize that um hold on. I just got done at Ulta and the restaurant so I got a couple things at Ulta not so much I picked up the MAC foundation I've been meaning to get for literally months at this point in NC50 so I got my correct shade I also picked up a couple lip products so I'll show y'all when I get home and then I got a free robe because it was like they had a promotion I guess you get a free robe or plush blanket if you spend a certain amount on fragrance i got a new fragrance this burberry one that everybody's been talking about i smelled it today girl girl that's all i gotta say i just got a small bottle the one ounce which the one ounce was i think 100 which is crazy that's pretty much it the sushi was pretty good i liked all three rolls the california was my favorite because it wasn't like too much going on for me and then i really liked the um the spider roll the spider roll was really good the boston roll i'm not a biggest fan of mayo so i feel like i kept tasting the mayo but i have a ton of leftover because i only had like six pieces anyways we're gonna head to the mall i think to go grab the uggs and then we'll go home from there I'm about to pull up to the mall, get Callie her Uggs. I think I'm going to get them at Journeys, but I just realized that I should have gotten them at Nordstrom so I can get my points. This spot is giving first class. <laughs> Ooh, we're not parking in the economy today. All right. Um, okay, let us go to get these Uggs and then I got to go home because I feel like I've been spending too much money today y'all so we are back home i feel like i've been out all day but um anyways let me show you guys what i picked up i got clay's thing right here i gotta wrap this up i'm gonna do that right now so i have my ulta bag so we're gonna do a little ulta haul everything else that i got is like for other people so this is clay's um callie's uh shoes up back here i'll show you all the ones that i got her i ended up going to two different three different stores the first two didn't have her size available um and then finally i got them at champs so just some uggs so these are the ones that i got i feel like this color is like the classic color and the classic height so yeah these are kind of like a staple shoe as well you know i feel like you always need a pair of like cozy boots for the winter and i got him a huge lego set like typically we get lego sets throughout the year but typically during the holidays we'll get like the bigger ones the more you know pricey ones because these lego sets are not cheap okay like <laughs> on to ulta they were giving out a free robe so i got a nice plush robe i was excited because i actually wanted a new robe and i was looking around today at nordstrom so I was happy about that. My current robes are all like really, really big on me. I needed a new one, so I'm excited to have one from Ulta. Then I picked up this Burberry Goddess perfume. This smells so good. This is the one I was telling you guys about in the car. This is the box here. You may have heard about it, but in case you haven't, go smell this. <laughs> it's so little. I should have gotten the 1.7, but it's okay this is what i got it's so tiny but it's cute though i guess i can't believe this little bottle is a hundred dollars i don't know who burberry thinks they are but that's crazy i've been purchasing a lot of perfumes lately so i figure the smaller one would be better so that and then i got the new foundation 
the Studio Radiance in NC50, which is my correct shade. I had been using NC55 for a while. I'm actually wearing it today, which it matches me pretty okay, but it's not my perfect match. So I'm happy to finally have this one. And then I got, I'll show you guys the bottle, I guess. This foundation and the Glossier foundation have been my two go-tos lately. This is what the bottle looks like. Then I got a new Chanel lip gloss. This one is in the shade Melted Honey, number 712. It's kind of like exactly what it sounds like, like a honey with some sparkle to it. So... This is what it looks like. I thought it was really pretty. And then I got a MAC lipstick in the shade uh, Modesty. I don't think I've ever owned this color. So this is the one I got. This is the color tone here. It's kind of like a mauve nude. And I thought it would be really pretty for just every day. This is the color. I think it's really pretty. Yeah. That's my little Ulta haul. I got to use my 20% of coupon. I'm so thankful to you guys because I literally had no idea. A few vlogs back, I had mentioned that Ulta stopped giving out the 20% of coupons. And then I got some comments saying the same thing. Like they realized they stopped getting the coupons after like the pandemic around that time. So then... I got some other comments, I, I want to say at least like five comments saying that they come through the app now, check your email, check the app, usually there's one in the app. This was not even that long ago. I literally checked the app today just because I was next to Ulta. There's a 20% off coupon in there. I said, what? What? And I didn't get an email about it. I'm pretty sure I didn't unless it's going to like my junk email, which I don't usually check my junk email but i was shook i was like what not only that i had 30 dollars worth of ulta like cash so i was able to get 30 dollars off plus 20 percent off which yeah thank you guys all right let me wrap this stuff up these are going to be real easy to wrap because they are boxes tell me why i was in the legos <laughs> I was at the Lego store and I'm checking out and I'm like, oh, do you have any gift boxes? I'm so used to saying it now, like every store I go to, I'm like, do you have any gift boxes? And he's like, oh, no, we don't. And I said, never mind, sir. This is literally the perfect box. Like, I don't know why I'm asking for a gift box for, a, for an actual box. <laughs> I'm mad he answered me too. Like, he must, girl, what did you do? What did you say Dang, not this roll already finished. I only wrapped two presents. Wait. Oh, there's more. That's crazy. This paper really is just not good overall. I don't remember where. I think I got this at Target. Like, it's really not good. I don't understand. Good morning, it's the next day, and it's so cold. It's freezing outside. Woo! All right, so I'm just gonna go grab some coffee, run a couple errands, and then we're gonna head home to work because we have some work to do. I lied. First stop is the gas station. Let's put my coat on because, girl, it's freezing out here. All right, so I just got to the coffee shop. I'm going to Roasted Coffee in Manuet if you're in the Rockland area. I don't remember if I've ever had their coffee, but I've definitely had their chai tea and it was pretty good. So we're just going to get coffee here today. And Oh, by the way, this is where I got my nails done. My toes. All right, let's go. Yay! I got a latte. I ordered a macchiato at first, but they make the macchiato like the authentic way with the little, it's a little cup, like this small. So he made me a latte instead. Hey y'all, so I just got done filming. I've been 
MIA basically all day. It's four o'clock right now because I had some filming to do. Hope you guys are having a good day. I actually also need to check my email because I feel like while I've been gone, I probably got emails. Every, whenever I'm like free and there's nothing going on, I'm like scrolling through my emails and there's nothing like dry city, Sahara desert. Okay, the moment I get busy and I'm like doing work, emails start coming in. And I'm like, why does this always happen? Ooh, my order has been delivered. Okay, I got some stuff from my outfit online. I had ordered a bunch of stuff. <laughs> I placed like three orders from them in the past few months because the first order, I really liked the uh, stuff that I got. Obviously, I had to order some more stuff. I ordered things during their Black Friday sale and then I ordered some more stuff. So that just arrived. So I'm going to go grab that. And then I need to order some pizza for my kids. Oh, all right. Oh. oh, girl. So I just ordered the food and I went to go get the package outside. It was raining and I didn't know. So it was sitting in the rain. So it's cold and wet. Well, this box is fine, but the other box is wet. And cold so i think i ordered just i think this is just tops i really love their sweats i got the green i got the black and then the navy blue i think is the other color i would feel like fits into my wardrobe so without further ado <laughs> let's get into this little haul i should really try these on like in little reels and stuff but maybe tomorrow who am i kidding i'm not doing that tomorrow <laughs> All right, so the first, I think these are all the same top, actually. And this is my first time ordering this style, so hopefully I like it. But I got this, like, mock turtleneck top. These are kind of, like, actual turtlenecks, really. But I got the black. I really like the look of mock turtlenecks. I wore one for Thanksgiving, and I think it looked so pretty. It was, like, the black long dress with the mock turtleneck. So I got all of these tops are the same. And then I got the brown like a cocoa color so pretty cannot wait to wear yes girl got you together okay i feel like this company is my new skims because the way i'm ordering from them is kind of how i ordered from skims when i first discovered like how good their clothes fit anyways these feel so good like i cannot wait to wear this this feels so good it's gonna definitely suck you in and then I, they were having a good sale by the way these are normally i think 40 i paid 20 something for each of these and they're normally like 40 i think let me see what's the regular price oh it doesn't say on here does it say on the little paper does it say on here it does not but i think these are like 40 dollars like 40 something but they were on sale for 20 something of a deal okay and then i got the green i already have the green sweats and i have a green mock um cut off shirt from them so i figure get the green long sleeve turtleneck as well so i could wear with those sweats so these are my little tops you guys should definitely see them in action starting tomorrow <laughs> but yeah that's what i got i'm gonna start cleaning up because my desk looks a hot mess um so yeah i need to clean because this is not cute Good morning. It's the next day. I'm just getting some work done on my laptop and it's to submit something to a brand. So that's what I'm doing. It's actually 12.30, so it's not morning, but I've been up working since morning. So I feel like, you know, so yeah, that's what I've been doing. I'm wearing my other Victoria's Secret PJs, which I really love these. All right, so I'm just going to work on this for a little bit more. I give myself until one and then I'll be done. I finished some other stuff late last night. So I've been really just trying to get stuff out the way. And I have another campaign to shoot tomorrow at Target. So I'm going to go do that with Johnny hopefully. And hopefully get that edited and submitted as well. Because I'm trying to like get everything done. So my schedule will be free. All right. So I it's a lot later. I just got ready. We we're about to leave. I had to improvise my outfit, not what I wanted to wear, but 
I got this top at Zara today and I really love it but this and the material is really like irritating to the point where I couldn't wear it I had it on for like an hour I cannot survive tonight with this on so I put a, a button down under it I'm not feeling this outfit at all it's not what I had in mind but that's what I have to do I need to run out the house now it's eight o'clock the movie starts at nine and we have like a 30 minute drive but we don't know about like parking and stuff since we've never been there so I'm gonna head out now I'm also gonna end this vlog here thank you guys for watching hanging out with me I love you Gen Z hug Gen Z heart <laughs> bye